this is the community. Once they know, what they, need, what they, they found out that this is the last refugee family coming today. Uh, coming. So we were so nervous that uh, we were so nervous because of the ban. We we thought that we might not be allowed to get in the U.S. But uh, fortunately, uh, we we got lucky and and, and here today. This was a perfect opportunity to see the religions of the world and interact with each other and also intersect with politics. It's kind of a great way to support the churches. I was a stranger program as well. So I, I just feel like this was an opportunity that probably wasn't going to come back and we needed to take advantage of it and be part of it. Um, it's been really eye-opening. There's been so much um, rhetoric on, on Facebook and all other social media outlets that um, you really don't know how to feel about it all because um, I mean, depending on the sources, they're very biased and it's really cool to come here and see their faces as they as they walk down the stairs and as they they felt everyone here um, encouraging them and they felt welcome. I hope they felt welcome. <laughs> Can you speak up, please? Thank you so much for your warm welcome.